Hello everyone, this is a new tool called Secrypt, which I made. Uh, it does two things. First of all, it encrypts data with multiple passwords. One of the passwords is the real password. The other ones appear to work, they decrypt the file, but they give fake data. The second thing it does is generate a password for data that is not encrypted. Why would you want to do that? Well, in Great Britain, law states that you must provide a password to anything they deem encrypted. If you don't, uh, if, it's, if it's bad enough, I assume, you can end up in jail. But random data like astronomical noise can be seen as encrypted because it has the same characteristics. And of course you have no password for random data because it's not encrypted. So to fix this, there's this tool. And I'm going to demonstrate how it works today. Uh, let's first generate a password file that's not encrypted. Um, we've got some random data here, which I just generated. And we want to decrypt it to Hello World. And then we download the password, it will become a key file, as you see. My downloads folder at uh, passworddata.random.key. Now if you decrypt data with password, we choose the random data to decrypt. So we got random data to decrypt and use the key file to decrypt it. When we view this text, it will become hello world. And indeed it says hello world. Now, what it can also do is encrypt data with multiple passwords. Um, so let's choose the image this time. I've got an image here, um, which I want to encrypt. We could also encrypt the message, but for now I'm going to go ahead and use the image. And we can add as many fake decryptions as we want. Um, for example, fake1 and fake2. And when we download this, it will become a zip file. Within there, uh, the encryption for this image. It will have the key file to decrypt the image correctly. And it, it will have two other decryptions, one, two other files, key files, one for decryption fake1 and fake2. So let's download and extract this. And we got the encrypted image, we got the real key which really decrypts it, and we got the fake decryption keys. So let's go ahead and test them. We got the uh, encrypted image, which is random data, by the way. Um, I could show you if you want to. And let's use fake decryption number one first. Uh, this should say fake one. And the second one should say fake two. And the real key should return an image. So let's download this one. It will download as a text file because it has no idea what we decrypted. But we know it should be an image. So if we change it so that it, uh, we remove .txt and make it a .png file and when that happens it becomes an image and it is identical to this one. So that's what this tool does. It um, can en encrypt data with multiple passwords and generate passwords for data not encrypted. Hope you liked it. Uh, it's open source by the way. You, you can view the source code. Uh, link to this page is in the, in the description of this video. And thanks for watching.